Hey, this is Edgy Bob One, and we're cooking with charcoal today. I'll move this in a little closer. The other day, when I first used the volcano stove, we used uh, propane. So today, we're using charcoal. I use some uh, instant light charcoal, even though I had some of this volcano rock, is what they called it, from the uh, volcano site, but uh, emergency essentials just cause it their fire starter. And I used some of that in the very bottom under the charcoal to help get a good flame going. And I'll just let that burn for a few minutes until it gets burnt and white on the outside and then uh, we'll be ready for the steaks. A couple of little side notes here. Um, this is the heat deflector or, or concentrator, whatever they call it. And uh, I'm not going to be using this. This is used more when you're cooking something in like the uh, a Dutch oven or something. So I'm going to put this back over here. When I put the steaks on and everything, I'll put this over on top of them. This is the, and it's real, really flexible as you can see. This is a heat cover, and it turns it into more of a uh, um, convection oven. That's, that's what I'm looking for, convection oven. And uh, you can put this over and it'll distribute the heat in there more evenly. Of course, since I'm doing steaks and we look like ours pink in the middle, uh, it won't be on too long. But uh, I probably will give it a try. You can see the charcoals are starting to turn whole, turn white, so it shouldn't be much longer, and we'll be back in a minute. Okay, folks, what I'm going to do now, according to the instructions, is you take the charcoal. I put approximately 12 in here. It said somewhere around about 12, and uh, I think these charcoal may be a little smaller than the ones they they use in the video. So, but they said just stack them around the side, and that's what I'm doing. And it said it would work better that way. Try to spread these out so that it kind of is uniform. All right, sports. Move it right along here. We're going to put the grill on top. Cut down on the uh, close to bed just a little bit. Put the steaks on. And we'll let those cook for a little bit. And this is the cover. I'm going to slide this over. And that'll make it somewhat of a convection type oven to cook a little more evenly. And we'll be back in a few. Okay, everybody. Uh, we're just about done. It takes a little longer when you're doing charcoal, and I've been used to cooking with gas for so long that uh, I'm having to reintroduce myself to cooking with a charcoal type grill. But uh, they are about done. They do look and smell really good. Let's take the uh, lid off. Oh, yeah, those bad boys. I think they're ready to chow down on. Just maybe another couple of minutes or so. They look really good. Good old filet and some potato with it. It is hard to beat. So this is pretty much uh, cooking with charcoal. I think next time I will add just maybe three or four more charcoal so I'll have enough to uh, completely encircle the inside. Um, next time we may even use some get some mesquite wood and throw that in there and try using some wood so I hope you enjoyed the video and uh, it's a great little stove and um, I'm, I'm very happy with it and y'all take care and God bless this is Edgy Bob one signing out